Alright guys, welcome back to Cthulhu Awakens. Now, let's get started on some actual Mind Fantasy 2 stuff. First off, we're going to need a carpenter bench. And, seeing as how, we've already gained a few levels through books from loot bags. We're going to need a second one of these. Where's my book? So you take the carpenter bench, put the book on top, and get a research station. You're going to need those. Research station can go right there. Carpenter bench can go right here. Hey, look at there. All right. Now, the book. Right here, you've got the basics. Crafting tools. Uh, you hit it with a hammer, a little cobblestone. You get pry rocks. That's the fire starter for the forge. You're gonna need that. Uh, timber and cobblestone. You get a stone hammer. You're gonna need one of those. Uh, when you get more copper and such, you can start doing copper of all, all different kinds. <laughs> Bronze, which is a step up from copper, iron, steel, uh, encrusted, which is basically diamond level, black steel, and amantium. I don't even know how to make that. I haven't played that far yet. But here's your basics. And then you go in to artistry. You can start opening up things in here if you get enough. I mean, right now, I've got enough to purchase research for bronze level and light armor. And you can just take those and put them in the research station and let it slowly work on its own in the background. Pretty cool. Now, we're going to give this the ultimate test. Okay. Yeah, it's starting to get dark, so. Sandstone, sandstone, sandstone. Whew. Hopefully, that holds. Alright, let's go down here. <clears throat> let's go down here and gather up all this stuff. Including this TNT. Keep it going, okay. Now it's night time right now. So we'll sleep. We'll sleep and we'll wait a moment. Here? No. The same. They're all dying except for the creepers and the as you know, they want to. Okay. Thanks. Ready? All right. Well, so far so good. The great thing about living <laughs> in an underground base 
in this pack is quicksand can be your friend. I'm gather up all this quicksand, put it to work for me. Between episodes, I'm gonna go actually do actual mining. Okay. Because I know of a way to capture mobs using quicksand, kill them, and get their drops. Because everything sinks through quicksand. Everything. I have no idea what's going on with that. <clears throat> First, let us go get some water. Because I'm going to be underground. I'm going to be wanting to plant things. What's that there? Hmm. Right, see? A little this, a little that. Yeah, those guys are in caves. So, ow! I hate those things. I mean, seriously, they really suck. What is this up here? It's on the back side of this here hill. Go, go away. What you want to do is avoid the quicksand yourself. But I also want to get up here and see what the heck is going on with this. Hardened sand. Ooh. Fall down. Oh, uh, yeah. Okay. It's a teeny tiny outback biome. I have no idea what's going on with chunks. But I'll fix it later. Yeah, teeny tiny outback. How about that? So, this is what I've got to work with. Hmm. So far, not too terribly bad. I need copper, a lot of it. I also need a lot of cobble. So all these places, like this, I'm going to come through, get the stuff that's on the surface, and get back out. Until I can get a mining tunnel set up. Okay. Ooh, elemental closed door. Take that. A little dirt. Ops, look at that. Oof, dang lag. Alright. Early starting out. <clears throat> First few days. It's easy to avoid mobs. Unless you're a fool and decide to go down into a cave. Like a so. Actually, this would be a good, good little starting hidey hole. You just get enough. <coughs> excuse me. Get enough dirt to seal this up. And you're good to go. But what I'm after is copper. Because I want to start making some tools. I'm making tools with copper for right now. Until I get enough artisanry points built up to actually make bronze stuff. And I also need to get back to my little hole in the ground before nightfall. So, where are we? Past noon. Okay. Go around. Check the 
sir, this tax going on here. Hmm. There we go. You build the chunk, please. Thank you. Sick of tired of chunk errors. Turn that off. Take a screenshot. Why not? <clears throat> and watch my frames tank. Great. Okay. Hmm. Shovel. Okay. But and then back to base. So in this pack, for every one log you get two planks. For every two planks you get two sticks. Yeah. Teddy's made it a little difficult. I'll just take that torch before some mob comes along, breaks it, and runs off with it. Okay. <clears throat> Now let's see here. I can put my quicksand. I can put some quicksand right here. Like so. And then come down. There, right there. Seal that back up. And just do one of these numbers. See? Drops come down. And then let's see here. Have to replace all that with sandstone. But that's not too dare too terribly difficult to do. <clears throat> There's a reason why I want to replace that with sandstone. One, when I dig out underneath it, it won't fall down. Two mobs won't go after it. Because, <clears throat> you know, sandstone's naturally very. I tell you, he's tried not to change it so that way the naturally occurring stuff is a target. Okay. Okay. Figured out what was causing the problem. Java update. God, I hate Java sometimes. There we go. So what we're going to do is we're going to open this up very carefully. Put in sandstone where we need to, which is most likely the corners. Ah, no. Then starting from there, do this number. And those. And we'll dig a new exit later, but now. these numbers and then uh, not that we'll just use up this and let's turn that into regular sandstone
actually. Doing all those numbers. <clears throat> I'll do that. And we'll take that and put it there. Okay. Come around the outside here. Do, do, do. Oof. No, you know, fall down like a dirt. <sighs> so basically, what this is going to be is a mob trap. And we're going to fall off there again. You know what? I'll just move that somewhere, I don't know, over here. Now the taller mobs. <laughs> Including the spiders. That's big enough for a spider to come through. <laughs> Drown and die. Now let's see here. For the tougher ones. Ooh, hi officer. I don't know if y'all heard that. That was a cop outside. <laughs> don't worry, he's not here for me. But yeah. Hmm. Well, something's going on outside. I don't know what's going on, but I should not be deterred. I should not be stopped. Don't stop me now. Hmm. One moment. Be right back. Okay. <sighs> Noises outside. Gotta hate them. Let's see here. Uh, some sand, some chiseled sandstone. Cobblestone in there. And sandstone. Back into slabs. That into slabs. We're going to use these slabs to our advantage. Because Ta -da. come on in, fools. Come get me. <laughs> I've done something similar before in the Karma mod pack, actually. I made a mob trap like this. And if they get close enough to find me, you know, if they're not completely stupid, Oh, yeah, good stuff. Okay. Yeah, they're not completely stupid, as, you know, zombies are wont to be. Let's just do that number right there. Okay. Come up. I don't need to come around there, though. Yeah. Oh, boo. Come and find me. Okay. Now, we've got all this room down here, right? We'll clear it out and make some more. That helps with the lighting some. Okay, got all that there. Okay. Come over here. Check in here. All good. Go. I think this is going to end up being probably where I'm going to put stuff where I need smoke to go up. And then I'll move it over here. Uh -huh. Okay, still good on the dirt. Alright. What? What did you choose break and where? 
Well, they broke something. Somewhere. But nowhere near me. Like, nowhere actually near me. Hmm. Well, let's go sleep for the night real quick. And go see what happened. Go die. <laughs> Creeper ran into a cactus. That's funny. like this, I love the desert. <laughs> Ouch. Bad guys will run into stuff. And thanks to Biomes of Plenty, I have quicksand to work with. So, let's see here. Sand. Let me put the sand around. Yeah. something somewhere hmm oh the stair <laughs> it broke the stair all right just so we don't have any more scares like that I'm just gonna break those stairs okay back down we go and all I need is three pieces of sandstone. Let's seal this back up. Sandstone there, sandstone there, and a torch. And a torch there. And a torch there, why not? <laughs> now, today's episode of this old temple. <laughs> Gonna be knocking down walls and making the place bigger. Okay. Alright, take out those. Why not? Put some sandstone down. <laughs> Dang it. One moment. Okay. So, curse made a noise. Curse you, curse. <laughs> okay. I will work on more of that later. But for now, let's put this, that, and put those there. There. Want to put a bed? Why not? Okay, so we need what little bit of cobblestone we have. We need to make a furnace to put right there. And then cook up this copper. Come on, come on, there we go, and why not? 
Uh, it's the only bit of armor we've got for right now. Come on. I'm on the pair already. I don't care if it breaks. I do care if this thing breaks, though. Hey, there we go. Cool. Okay. Yeah. Tired of walking on that. Okay. Let's go down here. Get some cobblestone. Maybe. Just maybe. Find some other stuff as well. Like, I don't know. Coal? Stuff like that. Rats. One thing about this pack, Teddy didn't put in soda can torches. <laughs> okay. put away a good bit of this stuff because we don't really need it. Uh, let's check on this. Oh, that's done. Good. That means we need to start looking for tin. You can get in there. Oh, leather. That's good. Okay, now, we need more cobblestone. <laughs> we need to construct more pylons. I mean, uh, no, we need, we need more cobblestone. <laughs> and there's a, there's a reason why you don't want to sit there and take your first three pieces of iron that you find and waste them on trying to make an iron pick. Teddy left the men for crafting purposes, but you can't mine anything with them. Now, to start out, you want 27 plus 4, 31 pieces of iron to start out with. Actually, no, scratch that, 34. 34 pieces of iron to start out with. There's a reason for that. You want 34 pieces of iron so you can make a crushing table as well as yeah, a hammer for magnetic craft, which is in this pack, along with your first three pieces for a bucket. Well, I've already got the bucket. I got lucky on that one. Uh, yeah, let's check around here at this level. Okay. Put down torch, and then we'll go back to my classic mining technique. Five. One, two, three. You go to the absolute length of your reach, and then you take your way to the end of it, and every other time you do that, you put down a torch at the end. I can't use that yet, but oh well. Got some limestone. You chisel that into the limestone you need for Mind Fantasy 2. Get some flux. Fine. Nothing yet as far as iron or copper goes, but. 
But the first things you're really going to want are timber, cobblestone, copper, leather. You're going to want all that stuff just to make, you know, your basic set of tools. So, I have a little bit of timber. And what I can do with that is make a stone hammer, a stone knife, which oddly enough counts as a sword. Hmm. Weird. Anyways. Okay. Where's my where's my out? Out, out, out. Uh, da, da, da. Where can I put that? And was it over here? Uh yep. It was over here. Ooh. It got dark. Huh. Weird. I am peaceful? No? I'm on easy. That's very weird. 